welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, my name is Abby. Same. Excuse me. Now I'm Steven. <laughs> uh, in today's video, we're going to be trying out the, what are these? MREs. MREs. Explain what these are. Uh, well, basically, uh, MRE stands for Meal Ready Eats. Um, these are basically uh, what you eat on deployments, I think. I've never been on a deployment myself. Um, but they're basically what you eat during boot camp, during field week, just because they're very convenient to have. And uh, just for, you know, the experience, you know, the uh, recruits are supposed to uh, be able to experience how to eat MREs and all the different examples. Uh, I think they do. I'm not sure. It's not like they have an expiration date, but you know, even if they were expired, for sure they <laughs> eat them. They'd make us eat it. Okay, so the one we have today is the vegetable crumbles with pasta. That's the and, one I'm gonna be getting. And uh, we also have the pork sausage patty maple flavor. And like uh, these were actually have already been field stripped and what that means is like uh, these come with uh, certain things like uh, sweets like candy you know you, sometimes you get m and Skittles and like uh, cookies you know little desserts here and there um, and field stripping is getting rid of those just so you can have the basic necessities for those um, and I have another one here this is the, uh, the beef taco so. you should do that one I'll do this one so this one, Actually, we're, we're this gonna one has breakfast. we're gonna do all of them. It doesn't matter if it says breakfast, and you're still gonna eat it. Like when you're hungry and you're out in the field, and you have nothing else to eat. You're gonna eat this. Okay. Also, none of these require um, to be microwaved or anything, right? Yeah, I mean, in the package, um, they do it themselves, right? Like they yeah, heat it up. Like, you, you just basically add water in there. Uh, and they're basically. We need to grab one. They'll, uh, no, we don't need one. They'll like, the chemicals inside will heat it up themselves and then uh, they'll be pretty hot to eat. It gets it gets actually pretty dangerous for the uh, for the liquid. Powder? Oh yeah, for, for the powders, yes. Like, okay, get so we're gonna get started on this really quickly. Um, so most of these come with uh, a trail mix, uh, some sort of a, uh, powder in it, like either a cappuccino or um, a grape uh, type of uh, Powerade, like their version of Powerade. Um, it's basically to keep you uh, well fed and, uh, and uh, this is a good way to get your uh, nutrition value. Um, I think each, each MRE contains up to like things like 3,600 calories. I could be wrong though. Okay, well, I'm gonna try the French vanilla cappuccino. What do you have for your drink? I don't, I don't think I have one. Like, uh, but in, in boot camp during uh, during field week and uh, and during MCT, uh, these become uh, the little beverages become the powders become very, 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 very valuable. And uh, most people. Not everybody gets them. Uh, no, they just use it a lot because it's always hot and you got to stay hydrated and people just get tired of drinking water over and over again So oh, so it's like something you guys want to drink. Yeah, so you uh, you trade them you trade other things for main meals But you never did that right? No, I did not. I uh, I actually got rid of those. I, I always drink water I try to stay hydrated. Alright, let's try this. How do um, we do it? Can we just pop it open like this? Uh, yeah, yeah, I mean So then what else here? I honestly don't recommend that at all. You want this? I mean, Have you had it? Yeah, I've had it, but that's not the way you can... I mean, that's not the way I would consume it. I mean, the way we did it, I literally just poured water in my mouth and threw this in there. Ew, you're nasty. Yeah, yeah it may I'll be nasty, you, okay. but we'll just put it in a little bit. It's not going to fully dissolve. I'm going to tell you that right now. How much do you put to the line? Yeah, a little bit more. Good? Yeah, a little bit more. Y'all are nasty. Yep, you can see that. Cause y'all didn't have a lot of time though, right? Well, no, we did. It depend. Yeah, it depended on which uh, what you were shooting. If you were shooting one, two, or three, or which table you were shooting. Um, most of these come with actually all of these come with instructions on how to prepare them. Um, but I am gonna say this about the powders: not all of them dissolve. It's just. Put some work into it. Okay. Yeah, she's she's gonna do that. Um. Well, mine didn't come with the powder. We'll both try this one. 
and I'm okay. I've already tried it before, but you just never tried everything. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And the and uh, the ones that aren't like uh, cappuccinos are like coffee right. flavored. That looks disgusting. You guys can see. No, I don't think they can, and I hope they don't. I mean, it's good, but it's not. You can still taste the powder because it hasn't dissolved all the way. It's good. It actually tastes like the Starbucks one, and five tastes better. Is that right? Yeah, I'm trying to upsell here, huh? Mm. And I've seen these in the in the commissary, and they're okay. like I think thirteen dollars per per bag or per sack. I don't know what you call those. All right, what's next? Try it, babe. Right. Give your opinion. I rate that a ten out of ten. It was really good. Tastes like French vanilla too. It's not bad. Well, no, it's not bad. I think probably some pa some people's is like they don't get the good batch. It's probably good batch. Well, no, they all taste the same. They're all like. But the thing is, like, you get real tired of it when you have it three times a day. <laughs> Cause uh, you want at, the rest? at MCT, no, I'm good. Oh, at MCT, you uh, you get you get three per day, um, and you just like you eat as you go. Like, I mean, you can choose when to eat it because they they have this little saying: uh, uh, "Chow is continuous," uh, which means you know you're always eating. Uh, as long as you have the time and you're not busy. Okay, let's try the applesauce. I actually, the applesauce is one thing I did stock up on. I always like this. Um, I have the mango. There's the mango regular peach. applesauce. Let's try it. And there's the mango. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not gonna lie, those are pretty good. Not bad, huh? It's a six. It's hot, that's why. Or it probably expired. <laughs> this one's good. The, re the original, 10 out of 10. Well, see, like this one is high in vitamins and, and calories. This one actually is 2,000 calories. There's 2,000 calories in this little thing. Hmm. So they make them with the intent to you get your uh, your calories per day because you when you're hiking when you're like maneuvering uh, Under fire or whatever you're gonna burn a lot of calories. I like the original the mango not so much. Just the original that one's good. Those were those are actually pretty high in value as well. All right, um, let's try something from yours. Okay, so I have regular Cheese spread. Oh, I, I hear that's nasty. It's it's not bad. Really? Um, no, I also got tortillas with the beef taco one, and then we have the uh, the beef taco itself, and then what is in here? The rice and beans. So. So what are you supposed to eat the cheese spread with? Uh, you just mix it in with whatever you got. Okay. Usually it comes with cracks or something. That's actually bread. Yes. So can we eat it with that? Or no? Yeah, you can. What's this? Jalapeno cashew. Those are actually pretty good. Those, those are. Let's worse. try the cheese spread. Ew! It looks expired. Everything looks expired. These are cheese spread, guys. Not bad. No, but like I said, anything you have from here. You're gonna have it repeatedly, and it just gets so old every single time. Like, because there's only up to like 24 different MREs, and like throughout boot camp and MCT, you like try them all, and more than twice, I guarantee it. Honestly, I would eat that if I had crackers. I would eat that. That's I right. do. I got peanut butter. But also another thing that uh, you have to keep in mind is when you're out in the field, you're, you're always so dirty and always so sweaty, so. Uh, the last thing you want is like making a mess with all this food, especially when the cheese is looking like this and you're trying to get every last little bit of it from a package like this. Mm. It gets really messy. That's why you open it like this. The peanut butter, peanut butter. I, was, I was never really interested in the peanut butter. I always traded that away. Mm. You can taste the nuts in it. There's actually nuts in the peanut butter. Mm -hmm. So there's two types of peanut butter. There's a chunky peanut butter, which is the one we have right now where you can taste the peanuts. Sounds and then good. there's the uh, 
The regular one, which is just like the spread. I like that one. I don't eat that. We got the cashews. How do you open this? So you're gonna open it from the side, you know, you just tear it. I'm not gonna lie to you, this is a lot of food. I don't think we should be eating all of it because it's high in calories. I'm not finishing it. I wanna try it. Tell them first. Well, this is what it looks like. Just regular. Oh, it's small. Yeah, they're like regular cashews. Are they hot? A little bit. Not really. Not to me. She don't like them. I like them. Okay. <laughs> a vegetable taco pasta left, and I have a piece of bread and an energy bar. Who should we try first? Your, let's try yours. Okay, but a uh, quick, quick little fact, I guess. These go by fast over there. Well, my my uh, my company they did. Everybody wanted these. I don't know why. They're pretty gross in my opinion. Should I try it real quick before we eat any of them? I'm not gonna try. I already know what it tastes like. I don't like You said them. we're trying everything. So we're trying everything. That literally looks like You know like what this bomb. smells like? This smells, you know what this smells like? You know like if the ladies had come around and they smell like. Wait, 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 before. She literally took a bite of vomit. Look at that. That literally looks like vomit. That don't even look like a bar. See, she can spit it out. See, she don't like that. I told her. I told her. No, you have to try it. I didn't like it. Apple cinnamon. Not a fan of cinnamon. Tastes nasty. Tastes like, it, it tastes like fudge. But then you guys know what fudge tastes like. Like the fudge cubes. It's like tacky and weird. Oh, shoot. Those are hot. All right, so another thing that I have is um, well, the main the main meals, you know, itself. I mean, these have uh, plenty of calories in them. Let me open this one up. When you open these up, you literally tear it all like that. Some of them, some of them tear actually right. tear right. And of course, they all come with a little spoon. It's falling out. This is fine. It's not gonna do anything. So it's already made. Back you up. Yeah, you just literally, all you're gonna do, grab it and eat it like this. Have you had that one? Mm-hmm. Is it good? It's all right. It's just like chili sauce. Mm-hmm. Beef taco, um, hmm. the pizza. That's how it looks, guys. It's a pretty good. The mac and chili, I think it's called. Those are pretty all. Those are pretty popular. Those are all go by fast. Uh, you know, people trade for those for the whole mm -hmm. MRE. They're good. Mm -hmm. What's this? Rice and beans. <sighs> Is it nasty? No, it's not nasty, but. How does it look? Like they're both rice and beans in there, or just it looks mush? Like, it looks mushed. Look. So this is, wait, hold on, we gotta show them. This is what it looks like. It actually looks nasty. <laughs> it's it's better than it looks, I'll tell you that right now. But it all tastes pretty good when you're all hungry and you haven't eaten for a good little bit. And you're out there in the freezing cold or in the blazing hot like, sun. When you go to the frozen aisle and they have like a package enchiladas, like a broccoli one, with mm -hmm. rice and beans, that's what that tastes like. Not bad, not good either. These you can get like in boxes of 12. I don't know how much those boxes are and I don't know where you can get them. I'm pretty sure maybe you can get them on Amazon. Or I'm not sure, but um. All right we, guys, go ahead, go ahead babe. When we first uh, saw these, we were, we were all re really excited. We all, we all wanted to eat them right away. But once we, um, once we had them all for a few weeks, yeah, we got pretty tired of it. People literally just traded them away like it was nothing. At the beginning, everyone like stole from each other. And, like, Are you gonna taste something? I don't think I'm gonna like what that. What is this? Vegetable pasta. Oh no, this one's disgusting. I hate this one. Did you ever get that one? Yeah, I got it like Did a couple you eat times. It? Heck no, I traded it away. Mm -mm. Nasty? Nasty. 
like the first day I remember. Mm -hmm. First day I had. Nasty. Nasty. Mm -hmm. It's not bad, but it needs like salt. And of course the tortillas. These are just plain flour tortillas. Like, honestly, you can't go wrong with these. They're not bad. I'm gonna put the cheese, the yeah, peanut butter put, on it. You can put the cheese or the peanut butter, whatever you want. These they come, they come in a pair. You know, there's two. Oh, this is literally what they sell in the package at the store. So, mm -hmm. with all the preservatives, though, I think it changes the flavor <laughs> for sure. Nope. And that, uh, last but not least, no, I'm not trying that. I don't even know what to do the plain. But they don't know. <laughs> Literally tastes like the same tortilla. Isn't it? They don't taste like the same one you buy at the store. It tastes a little different. I think it's because of all the preservatives. Bread. The bread, I'm not gonna lie, I did trade a lot for these. The bread, they were, they were always pretty good. Just because they were always like, like this, like plain. You ate it like that? Yeah. Actually, you'd put the, like, sometimes they'd give you a jelly spread, and, like, you'd it'd just make the best of it. Like, yeah, you, you can put the peanut butter on here. Makes it ten times better. It actually is good. Mm. Let me try the cheese spread. I'm not gonna lie, these will never disappoint in an MRE pack. Really? Never disappoint. Mm. 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 You know, it's like uh, like I always like to point out, they either come with some sort of nuts or a trail mix, or something to take up that spot. Let's see. Yep, regular trail mix with smushed M and M's. That's smushed M and M right there. What are these packages in there to keep it fresh? No, to keep it preserved. Those are that will help it stay in um, edible condition. These are okay. Just like regular uh, trail mix. But these kind of have an aftertaste of. Everything will have an aftertaste, I feel like, just because they've been in the packaging so long. Now, who makes MREs? The military? You know, or not really? Not really. I think it's some company. Like when you um, when you read the bag, it says uh, the Warnick Company, Cincinnati, Ohio. U.S. government property commercial resale is unlawful. So. Okay, you can't resell really these then. Not really. Um, but I see some wives try to sell these. They sometimes do it. <laughs> Uh, they're not really supposed to. That's why I say sometimes you can get on Amazon, maybe, maybe not. Oh, and they gave us a chili and lime hot sauce. Oh yeah, some... Is it good? Uh, not really. Can you open it on it does. It does change the flavor to the, some things that you might not like. Let me try it with like the... the... Like the vegetable thing, it'll make, oh, it'll change the, the taste of it for sure. There it is. Okay, yeah. Okay. Tastes like. I don't really know, but it tastes like too tangy. Tangy? Well, it's yeah, a it's chili lime. and lime hot sauce. Not all come. Not all MREs come with this, but uh, the ones that do, do. Yeah. They probably give it to. The it comes usually with the like the. Like the stuff that, oh, would you look at that? <laughs> a roach, a little small roach. It's not a roach, it's a little bug. It's a little. It's not a roach. Oh yeah, it's a little bug in the uh, in, in the MRE market. package. That's why you, sometimes you gotta double check to make sure. One one of my friends actually got food poisoning from uh, from one of the MREs. It didn't sit well in his stomach. He just puked it all out. The rest of the day he was just like all green, all. Oh, not bad memories, bad memories. And at the end of the the chow time, you just basically put all the garbage in the MRE bag and then you throw it away. 
Um, I must say, I do not miss these. Like I said before, at the beginning, when we first like were notified we are gonna eat these, we were all really excited about them, but as we uh, ate these away, we kinda got really tired of them. Have you <laughs> Everything's going. One last one. Uh, no, no, no. You okay. said, you literally said, you can't lie to them now. You said we're uh, trying all no. of them. Okay, well, this one's not bad. I don't think the main meal is even in here. So this one is the uh, pork sausage patty, maple flavored. Uh, this one's actually... A breakfast one? Well, no. Yeah, I can get in. Where does it say breakfast? Pork, pork sausage patty, maple flavored. That doesn't mean, that doesn't mean it's breakfast. What do they give us? What's this? That's actually the patty itself. What's this? Smoked almond. Okay, we're not trying the peanut butter. Who are you trying? And that? here's the table syrup. This goes. This syrup goes with this patty. Oh, I want to try this. See, and so this is what I'm talking about with the uh, with the little beverage powders. This is a grape flavored. So when you would mix it in the water and kind of make like the purple Gatorade. Here. So you could choose to either put it in a bag or like if you had a canteen or a bottle of water. Um, I don't think many of us had that. I mean, we all had the canteen. So we'd all just like mix it in the bag or just mix it in. Now, did you always get a drink with your mouth? Uh, like you had your canteens. Like, and if you were out of water, you had, you know, your chow time to go refill that. No, but did you always get a packaged drink? Oh mouth? yeah, for sure, for sure. Yeah. Unless like, so before you went, good. it does smell like that powder. It stuff. smells like Kool-Aid. Yeah, it does. So uh, how are we gonna do I this? I wanna do it in the, yeah, this. In the bag? Okay, it's gonna be hard to mix in though. Want that boot camp experience. See, the thing is, it's turning blue. It's not even purple. See? Well, this isn't just the boot camp experience. This is literally just like eating food. What made this so like, I guess exciting you can say, was the fact that you're being miserable out there with everybody else. That's the big experience. Yeah. So you gotta mix this in well. They don't ever dissolve all the way, which is what I hate. But yeah. Um, but yeah, when you had your chow time at, uh, at boot camp or uh, MCT, you would be uh, getting a, you'd get like maybe depending how much time they gave you, you'd get time to like eat and also like if you needed water for your canteen or your water source, you'd go to a little spigot or something and just refill your water. Usually, usually there were, there was a lot of standby time at MCT so you could like, refill or eat a little snack from your MRE, you know. That's why it came with so many different packages. Packages so you could eat a little bit here, a little bit there. Well, you can go ahead and try it. Here, let me add a little bit more water. Might be very concentrated. No, the more water you add, the better, because at one point it gets too sugary. You know, like, I personally would drink those like with a lot of water. Let's try the almonds while we're shaking this. The almonds, well, these are basically like regular almonds. The, when, it, when it comes to nuts and trail mixes, stuff like that, like peanuts, um, those aren't gonna change much. Like, they're not gonna, the flavor isn't gonna change. Any other thing, like tortillas, peanut butter, uh, syrup, that's gonna change a little bit. This patty, it's, it's gonna be pretty nice. I don't know from experience, this isn't bad. All right, how do we drink it then? Yep, just like that. <laughs> Old boot camp style. She likes it. That's pretty good. That's one of the things you could actually enjoy back then. Because it was so freaking hot during the day and so cold during the night. Mm, not bad. Not bad. See, that's too sugary for me. Okay. Just a little bit more water would be good. That usually makes up to a 32 ounce. Um, yeah, those make up a pretty good amount of uh, Gatorade or whatever you want to call it. Of uh, 
bit, so. Oh yeah, let's open up the, the patty. Oh boy. Ew. I don't want to eat that. Are you going to have to? See, when that doesn't even look good. So this is what it looks like. That looks nasty. It does I'm look just good. like we'll get food poisoning. Probably, but... No, let's not eat that. No. Do you want the rest of this? No. It's good, it still looks like, I'm telling you, it has so many preservatives, this will stay like, it's probably, this box is, or like, this MRE is probably like from 2006. Nope. Oh my God. See, that's why they added this the little syrup, so let's put it in there. It's nasty. Yeah, everything is nasty. Actually, no, not everything was nasty. You know it looks nasty too. Everything looks nasty, but when you're hungry, you're hungry. Not hungry for that. Oh, but when you're out there, yes. Yes, you get hungry. This is actually considered, this is one of the better things from that one. I would rather eat that vegetable pasta over that. All right, so. No, just like, there you go. All right. So Can I just do my bite and get over with? Yeah, so this has been mixed. That's too big of a bite. This has been mixed in with the uh, with the syrup. It should taste a little bit better. That's what it looks like. It doesn't even look like a patty, to be honest. She took, she didn't even take half of that. I made it, it better. It tastes like Spam with syrup. What is pork? Actually, not even spam. It tastes like potted meat. No. Well, if none of these have changed from the time mm -hmm. that I went to uh, Who Kevin and I ate these. They taste like exactly what I thought they would. They're all nasty. There are a few exceptions here and there, but overall nasty. Yeah, I guess so. Yep. Well, guys, that was the end of our video trying the MREs. We're gonna throw these away now. How long have you been having these? How long have you had these? Oh, uh, so, so those I was, uh, I saved them from uh, MCT. Um, it's so been a like long time. Three months? Yeah, something about. Yeah. Four months, actually in five. Four or five months, yeah, you can say that. But yeah guys, this is the end of the video. If you like this video, go ahead and let us know. And if you wanna see like more, I guess, military videos. Or footage of this stuff. Yeah, just let us know and we'll film it. Did you like it though? Like the stuff that was food? Uh, out of a 10, what would you rate it? Probably like a five. Really? I rate it a seven. I, honestly, a lot of the stuff, like the peanut butter, cheese spread, all that wasn't really bad. Maybe because I've been traumatized by it. Like I already know, like uh, it brings back memories that I don't want to think about right now. Probably. Uh, but yeah. Anyways, thanks guys for watching this video. Until next thank time.